So I'm here with Doyle today in uh, Spartanburg, South Carolina. How you doing today, man? I'm doing great. How you doing? Doing pretty good. Doing pretty good so far. So um, you're obviously ready to go on in a little bit and stuff. Uh, Davy Suicide's playing right now. So uh, before before you go on stage and stuff, what are some things you do to get ready, whether it be with your makeup and warm-up techniques and all that? Uh, I really don't warm up, so um, just tape my fingers and put my shit on and go. <laughs> all right, man. Um, so taking care of yourself on the road and everything with like your workout routines and stuff do you feel that that has more of a benefit to you playing live with your performance and everything sure yeah it uh gives you a lot of energy okay awesome now with uh davis who's i being the opening act on this tour do you see something in you, in him that you saw that you that you saw in yourself when you're younger or something like that or just just a reflection of yourself trying to make it as a musician unfortunately i never see the opening bands oh okay <laughs> doing all this okay okay awesome all right. Starting out when you did a long time ago and stuff, did you ever think whether it be with your solo stuff or Misfits, you'd be as big of an influence on the music community as you are? Um, I guess when you're doing that, you know, being in a band, in the beginning you always think it's going to do great. So yeah. probably, yeah. Okay. Were you, were you shocked by any of the results of how long you've been relevant and stuff? Okay. <laughs> Okay, so the record and everything, how did you push yourself creatively, I guess, in ways that you haven't done in the past with previous albums, or were there any uh, new things you tried that you haven't in the past? Um, no. Nah. <laughs> so, so what's the recording process with, uh, for you like and all that, with that kind of stuff? Like, how do you get, do you just have a routine that you're setting? It was setting? hell. It was, it was hell. hell. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um... It was, right? <laughs> <laughs> How was the hell? Do you want to talk about, about that? or? Right. <laughs> the mixing and mastering. Mixing, mastering. It's a lot of shit. Goes, it's a lot of work. Yeah, that's something I noticed listening to it today is that the production sounds very raw on it and stuff. Um, is raw? that Well, in, in a good way. Like, oh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> not not like bad or anything. But you know how a lot of bands today, they're very digitalized, very through a computer. Oh, and yeah, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, you could tell that, that it had a live element. And I've heard somebody once say that. Recording is supposed to capture the live element and not the other way around. So, is that something you strive for when you, uh, when you guys make these records? I just try to do it the best I could. I don't copy and paste stuff. You know, I don't play the the, the verse once and move it over here. And you know, it's all played through. Um, what are the expectations you have dropping this album and stuff? Where do you see it going, and where do you want to hit hit it with your career and stuff? Uh, I just want everybody to know that it exists. Okay. And. Uh, streaming and stuff has become prevalent today in society and with sales being as bad as they are with records and stuff what do you see in your eyes as a successful record in 2017 what could this record do to be a success um just bring us more people to the shows okay as long as people are singing it doesn't really matter i guess or anything nah. okay all right and what are your future plans after this tour for the fall and all that stuff if you can talk about anything like that we're booking more shows okay yeah all right sweet and the last question here, what is uh, what is a meaningful or unique fun fan interaction you've had over your career, something that sticks out to you? A what? Like a meaningful fan interaction or meeting somebody or something unique that sticks out to you? Um, I was sitting in this bus one time and you know the baseball pitcher, Randy Johnson, mm -hmm. opens the door and says, hey, do I'll come hang out after I film these guys. And we were like, what? And he <laughs> the door and left. All right, awesome. And uh, I actually do have one more. Are there any more plans for a Misfits reunion shows or anything like that that you guys have done recently? Um, I'm not allowed to talk about that. Okay, that's fine. All right. Sweet. Well, thanks for your time today. Looking forward to seeing you a little bit. I'm Trent with uh, Sound Lake Magazine with Doyle. So thanks for watching.